Hey everybody, it's Rob Freeman, and, um, and today we're answering your green risk management questions. Uh, today we're talking about what behind the meter means. And you may have heard the term behind the meter if you're looking at buying a solar system or you're interested in renewable energy for your home or you're thinking about energy storage, battery energy storage for your home or for your building. And uh, you may hear the term behind the meter. And, um, but a lot of people are confused about what behind the meter means because where am I in relation to the meter? Am I in front of the meter? Am I behind the meter? I just want energy independence. So a good way to think about what behind the meter means is imagine yourself standing outside your house looking at your electricity meter and you're watching the dials spin showing how many kilowatt hours are being used and when you look at it you're standing in front of the meter looking at the meter and whatever's behind the meter is basically attached to or on top of or inside your house so a behind the meter system is basically in your house or part of your house and it doesn't actually have to touch the utility so when you think about a behind the meter system you're standing in front of the meter whatever's behind it meaning your house you're looking at the meter and whatever's behind it, it's attached to your house your house is behind the meter that's a behind the meter system so energy storage the solar system on your roof those things can be used as a behind the meter system. Whatever's in front of the meter is going to be behind you. So it's going to be the utility, the lines, everything else. Uh, so if you're relying on a in front of the meter system, then that's what you're going to be relying on. You're going to be reliant on the utility. So thanks for watching. And um, I love answering your questions about uh, green building and green risk management. So um, feel free to contact me and have a great day.